All right, this is my 100 day planner. It came with these stickers and it cost, let's see, 5,801. I got it from Artbox. All right, so they did have another version. It was smaller and cheaper, but I decided to go with this one. All right, so. Oops, all right, still on yellow. Go this way, page, let's go this way. All right, this is where you start off with like your measurements and stuff. And this one is where you finish at the end of the 100 days. This is for like your timetable for the week. This is your timetable for the weekend. You know, most people have a different schedule on week and weekends. The purple one is your starting weight. So then you go up and you can go down and at the bottom, it goes by like 10 days, 20 days, and all the way out to the 100 day marker. This is your monthly calendar. This is for like, I guess like plans and stuff like that, if I remember correctly. Um, and this is like what actually happens. So it's like what you ate, working out, and then how much you weighed. Oh, and this is your goal for the month. Okay, so let's go out. All right, you have many of these pages. Okay, so every for every 20 of these pages, you're gonna have a different page after, and that's gonna be like your assessment pretty much for like the month, like marking where you are currently. So you got your day, pretty much your date, breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack, don't remember, cardio, probably weights because it said no breath, water, this is like food you're eating, like what you actually ate and stuff like that, this is how you feel, and this is just for memos. Alright, so we're going to go pretty much to the back. See, many, many, many pages. This, okay, so you have five of these pages. All right, so this is the last one. So this is going to mark, you know, where you were for the last 20 days, where you finished up the last 20 days, and the difference. I think this is something about food. I can't remember um, what this was. I'll have to check it out again before I start writing in this. This is the end, like your measurements at the end. You had one in the beginning. Well, now you have one at the end of it. All right, then you have this part, which is about food. So this is like what you cooked and how you cooked it, you know, like oil and stuff like that. Or at least that's what I'm understanding when I translate it. So a few pages of this, like a recipe book. This one seemed like it was recipes when I translate it, but it's not really recipes. This is like, which I guess like what you actually ate probably most of the time and like a little memo section. But this one and the other one seem very similar to me. Okay, so this one is actually, if I remember correctly, I think exercise, so like what you did, exercise times and stuff like that. And then we're going to go here, which is just writing pages. But yeah, I'm going to start on this planner. I got it from Artbox. I think it's probably a good planner. There were some cheaper options. You could get um, one that was about three or 4,000 won, and it was like for six weeks. I decided to purchase this one because I'm like a few more, and you know, it's got many more pages, and the pages are more detailed. Then they had two like list ones. One was for like water and stuff like that, and the other one's like your food and everything intake. Um, so they're pretty much good. I mean, the water one I think had exercise on it. But those are like you could take them and stick them in your current planner. I want it my own planner. All right, so I will start writing in this now that I actually have my trainer and I'm with him again. 